Are you happy with the person that's in charge of your life? Are you satisfied with the person that's guiding you, making the decisions in your life? The other day, I was on board a plane and the captain came over the intercom and he said, Hi, ladies and gentlemen, this is Captain Jones and I'd like to welcome you on board flight uh, 123 or is it 321 or 561? I'm not really sure, but it doesn't really matter because guess what? We're just going to take off, fly a little bit east, maybe a little bit west. Cruise around up, up top. Oh, and by the way, I have no idea how much fuel we've got on board, but that doesn't really matter because we've got no idea where we're going. Do you know somebody who's got a captain like that in charge of their lives? Would you stay on board an aeroplane with a captain like that? Or would you run off that plane as quickly as you possibly could? I know I'd get off that plane. Who's running your life? Are you satisfied with the person that's in charge of your life. The person that's making the decisions every day that decides what your future is going to be like. Are you happy with that person? If you're not, you can change. You know, a genius without a roadmap can get lost or will get lost in any city. Whereas an average person with a map can find out exactly where they want to go. And that's what I'm challenging you and I'm saying to you today. What plan do you have? Do you have a road map? Do you have an idea where you're taking your life? Because until you do, you could be going anywhere. When you drive out of your driveway in the morning, you know where you're going. And guess what? If you don't, what do you do? Do you turn left? Do you turn right? Do you go straight out? Or are you just like a paper cup that's blowing in a car lot? Blowing from side to side with absolutely no direction, with no idea of what you want with your life. You know, the paper cup may blow to the pole where the dustbin is and get thrown away, but it's probably just going to blow around in the car park with no direction. And that's the challenge that most people have in their lives, is they allow themselves to be a paper cup that just gets blown around. If you don't have an idea where you're going to go, you can land up anywhere. Do you want to Take the risk with your life and allow your life to just drift and let things just happen to you by chance? Or do you want to take control of your life and actually make your future exactly what you want it to be? And that's what I want to help you to do, is to teach you, to guide you, to help you to get to the point where you can actually have a plan that is going to deliver the future that you want. Don't just drift through your life aimlessly. I'm sure you all know what a global positioning system is. How, how does it work? It, it triangulates and it figures out where you are. And then you need to tell it one thing. You need to tell it where you want to go. And then it does all sorts of incredible things and it builds out a route and it takes you from here to where you want to go. Your life's exactly the same. You're a human global positioning system. You need to be honest, do a self-audit of where you're at at the moment. Figure out what's working in your life and what's not working in your life. And then decide where you want to go. How do you decide where you want to go? Where you want to go is your dreams. It's your goals. And then you need to put a plan in place that will take you from one to the other. Bearing in mind that planning must be flexible. When, when the space shuttle takes off from Cape Canaveral and it takes off into space, if it's one inch off its trajectory, it'll miss the moon by 300,000 miles. So what do they do? As the space shuttle goes up into space, it makes short, tiny in-course corrections to bring it back on track. And that's what you need to do in your life as well, is you need to know that your plans have got to be flexible. They've got to be something that you can um, mold to suit your changing needs. And if you make plans, you need to take action on those plans. You need to have a system to make them work. And I like to think of it as a child's join the dots, kiddies puzzle. And if you look on your successes, simplicity. All I need to do is wake up in the morning, take action. Just a few small actions, persistent actions every day that are going to lead me closer and closer to the success that I desire. And if I do that every single day, 
My success is guaranteed. So stop just drifting through life like that paper cup any longer. Take charge of your life. The results will be magnificent.